Hello, I'm Alan Chaffer with King 5 News, and you're watching TCTV Breaking News. You're watching TCTV Breaking News with Allison Foster and Conrad Brine. Entertainment with Cheyenne Romero. Weather with Garrett Roy. Plus, Jaden Holside and John Zarate behind the scenes. TCTV Breaking News starts now. Let's call this news meeting to order, and I've got you all here. We're going to work on the stories for today's newscast. Um, does anybody have any any ideas for a story? Um, I'm working on my interview. Okay, who are you? Inter oh, this is your interview for the the uh, theater yeah, camp. I'm coming up with questions. Hi, I'm Cheyenne Romero, and I'm at OFT Combat Camp today. Miss Chandler. How long have you been a part of OFT? Well, I was one of two founders. We founded the organization five years ago, so I've been there since the beginning. Have you ever had stage combat experience? I have had a little bit of stage combat experience. Um, I was actually in Jungle Book that we produced a couple years ago, and so I got thrown to the ground and that kind of fun stuff. We have Sky with us today. Okay, Sky. Um, how long have you ever been to an OFT camp before? Yes. All right. Um, which camp was it? Um, well, I've been to four camps and I can't remember all of their names. Um, it's really fun because we get to learn fake fighting and um, interacting with other people we don't know and get to know those people. And what is your name? Ella. All right, Ella. Um, have you been to an OFT camp before? Uh, yeah. Um, do you remember which one it was? Not really. <laughs> was it fun? Yeah. All right, we've seen a lot of stage combat today, and these kids seem to have a lot of fun. Thanks for joining me at OFT camp. Okay, so what made you decide to sign up for this uh, breaking news camp? I'm not talking to you. Um, are you still mad that you're Yes, a yes, I told you I'm not talking to you. Leave me alone. Well, you know, I, I told you, you can't really be anchor with blue hair. Have you ever seen an anchor with blue hair? I've never seen anybody on the news with blue hair. Okay, everybody loves blue hair, and I told you, it's really in right now, and if there were anchor women and anchor people and all those people on the news that had blue hair, then I would totally watch it. And not a lot of people watch the news, especially not me, and especially not a lot of kids. But if somebody showed up on TV with blue hair, we'd all watch it. Because somebody would be like, oh my gosh, my mom was watching the news today, and she's like, oh my gosh, Gene Anderson has blue hair, and it's so in right now. Hey, I'm Cheyenne Romero from TCTV Breaking News. I want you to know that I'm absolutely the only entertainment reporter that is truly entertaining. If I can't find anything entertaining to report on, you can be assured that I will make it my mission to entertain you myself. Romeo, take me so Watch me every weekday on TCTV Breaking News. Watch Shayana Romero on TCTV Breaking News. That's good. That's your promo, and you're, you're interviewing the, the theater camp, and that's good. So I'm going to write down that we got the uh, theater camp package. So the theater camp package, we need to work that into the script. We need to write a, uh, a pitch to that and a, a teaser for the commercial breaks, okay? I don't know for, what it is. For the, you don't know what a pitch is and a, and a, and a, a teaser? Do you remember what a teaser? Who, who told me? What's a teaser? A teaser Conrad. is like one of those things uh, where they go like, Oh, I've seen oh, those before. before. I know that. We'll ask them more after this. The Russians have invaded Western Europe. We'll tell you what the U.S. response will be. Are the news anchors at TCTV untrustworthy? We'll have the truth later in the broadcast. But first, are vampires and werewolves bad for your health? Why are so many people dying from twilight? We'll tell you how you can keep your children safe, but only if you stay tuned until the very end of the broadcast. All right. So, Allison, do you have any, any stories, story ideas uh, for, for this yeah, news camp? Yeah, I wrote a news story. This is a story about... I signed up for the breaking news camp because I wanted to learn something new. I've never done anything television and or news related, and I wanted to see how it works. Today, a woman stopped a terrorist bombing on a plane with nothing but a pen and an aircraft pillow. Witnesses say that she threw the pen as a distraction and used the pillow as a club to beat him with. Those pillows are uncomfortable, huh? 
Join me, Allison Foster, every weekday at 5.30 for highlights of today's breaking news. No other anchor will walk you through the most relevant and current events with non-biased information from a variety of reliable sources. A local newscaster like me will inform you about important things happening right here where you live. So make this day and every day a TCTV News Day. Watch Allison Foster on TCTV Breaking News. We need to work on your graphics for tomorrow's newscast. Yeah. And we need to work on a promo. Yeah, I've been thinking about that. What do you got so far? Um, Peter Piper fit the back of pickled peppers. <laughs> Peter Pepper pit the peck of pickled peppers. Is it going to be raining on Peter while he picks his peppers or is it going to be sunny? I'm Garrett Roy at TCTV Breaking News and I'll let you know whether the tropical depression east is going to fit the weather here in the west. Tune in weekdays at 5.30 for the most accurate weather forecast around. And Peter Piper, if you're watching, I want my pickled peppers back. Watch Garrett Roy on TCTV Breaking News. So, um, and you are uh, our, our teleprompter operator. Have you been have you been practicing your teleprompter movements? Well, the hard part is you have to time it just right, like how fast or how slow you're going according to how they're reading. So it's kind of challenging how to make it like stay three. there, like for like the amount of time that they the so. game, What are your some of your teleprompter movements? Can you show us? So you've been practicing that at home. Good. Now you wrote an excellent international story yesterday. What was that about? It was about the fictional story of Russian invasion. The Russian invasion. I like that story. Okay, I'm going to put that. That may be our lead. Today's top story, we've heard of the Russian military controlling the western land of Europe. They may have caused the 93 deaths in Norway, though we haven't heard from the American Army Force confirming that the Russians caused the siege. Uh, well, I signed up because this is one of the most interesting camps that I saw when I was looking over, mostly because I've always wanted to do um, newscasting, learn how this stuff works. I've never really known what a producer did, but now I do, and it's, it's kind of cool because it sounds like a fun job to be, like, overlooking everything. And you got the job of anchor, though. Yes, I did. Would you rather be reporter or, or uh, producer or anchor? Anchor, definitely anchor, because I like being on camera and talking. Sally sells seashells down by the seashore. More at 5.30 with Garrett Roy on weather, Jaden Holside on sports, Shayana Romero with entertainment, a trusty cameraman, John Zarate, and anchors Allison Foster and me, Conrad Bryan, on TCTV Breaking News, where we solve all the not-so-important mysteries of the universe and talk about all the subjects you don't care about and ignore the ones you do. Watch Conrad Bryan on TCTV Breaking News. Conrad Bryan here, and I'm here to resolve those rumors about the TCTV news anchors being untrustworthy. Well, those rumors are true, totally true. I'll even show you a clip from Allison's last story. There's a big fire on Kempton Street, or is there? There's also been some talk about how the weatherman is uncaring and mean. Thunder and lightning on 6th Street, but I don't live there, so HA! But then again, this is cable, so we don't really care what you think. And on that note, we go to Shay with the entertainment news. Hey, this is Cheyenne Romero. I'm here to tell you about this really crazy thing that happened to me last night. So, I was walking down the main road to get home from this amazing sled party when I noticed that... <laughs> But, you know, today, I kind of think it was a dream. The people were really nice there. We got to meet a few of the anchors. They were nice. Well, I learned a lot of things on the tour. Um, I really enjoyed meeting the helicopter pilot. I just thought that was really cool. They're moving the cameras around for you guys and, and, and <laughs> messing with so you. That's so cool. Isn't it? Well, this is a cool place. Well, I was thinking like the best parts were how many people it was like that took how to just make like one show. Like there's the cameraman and then the director and then the sound effects person. And there's a lot of different jobs just to make that show. This whole job is about multitasking. So kind of looking two steps ahead and um, you get to push a lot of buttons, so it's fun. They like pushing buttons. Yeah. Especially mine. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, They're good. Uh, uh, They're all good. 